A training session at Eau Claire Memorial is helping law enforcement on a local and regional level learn how to respond to a crisis situation. WEAU's Melanie Walliser shares what they were training for and why area law enforcement take the time to practice emergency scenarios. Law enforcement agencies often train together to prepare for large-scale emergencies. Today, ECPD and Eau Claire County Regional SWAT team held a training scenario involving a male barricaded in a classroom. The student um, has been having some problems with some of his friends, uh, tried to address it with the school resource officer and was not happy with how the school resource officer handled it. Um, became violent with the school resource officer and ended up um, hiding out in a classroom and ultimately took some students hostage. The participating agencies split into a tactical response team and crisis negotiations team. Everybody has a role, everybody has a purpose. And um, once we come together in this training and everybody respects their role, respects their purpose, it's, 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 um, it, it's a lot easier to come to a successful result because of that. Law enforcement aren't the only people who play an important role in these scenarios. Unfortunately and tragically on a national scale, we've seen that these types of incidents, they do happen at schools. It shows the importance of having school resource officers uh, being there, being able to gather intelligence, having familiarity with um, the students, with their families, uh, to be able to pass on that information to the responding officers and specialties. While the training was done at a high school, Deputy Chief Derek Thomas says it ensures more than school safety. This incident, although it's being placed at a school, um, it certainly can be helpful to have this same type of scenario that can be within any building, any residence, and to have that familiarity with each other um, within our cross uh, specialties is, is important. After every emergency scenario training, leaders from all participating agencies will discuss what went well and what they can improve on. In Eau Claire, Melanie Walliser, WEAU 13 News. And Deputy Chief Thomas says trainings like this are held at least once or twice a year.